concerned about this falling off and crushing me when I'm trying to sleep. Mildly. actually like started the intro of this video yet so hi oh wait that's crooked <laughs> disclaimer before i even say anything um i am i'm not gonna be making like any eye contact with the camera right now because i'm trying to avoid screens as much as i can because i have a headache so yeah, whenever that happens, I'm like, I'm gonna try not to stare at screen. Which sucks, cause like, I mean, not to sound like a, I don't know, but like, I get bored. I don't know. I just, you know. So basically, I have a headache. And yesterday I had one too. And I looked up on YouTube. I wanted to see if anyone made like a self-care day for when you have a headache or something or just don't feel good i couldn't find anything i would just be stupid maybe it has been a thing or whatever but i didn't find anything i only found like headache relief pressure points and stuff like that sorry i wanted to sit back so i moved you <laughs> i'm like sitting here like... <laughs> uh so yeah i when i realized that i couldn't find what I was looking for, I was like, guess I'll just have to make it myself. So if you've ever had that problem where you're like, I have a headache and I don't really know like what to do for it, but I kind of want to like have fun and have like a self care moment, but I also can't find a video on it. Then you came to the right place. <laughs> Anyways, I feel like it's kind of hard to believe that I have a headache right now. <laughs> so yeah, earlier I did yoga for migraines. There's also a yoga for headaches video. I think I just have a headache, but I always do the migraine one just because I like that one better. Yeah, I did that and then I painted and drew as you saw. The last time I painted was probably like, I think it was like a senior. So that was like three years ago. You know how sometimes you're like, okay, I'm feeling a little better, but I'm very delicate. So that's why I was like, I guess I'll just be crafty or something. I just wanted to do something relaxing, you know? And now, today's the day I'm finally making my own headache self-care video. So, I'm home alone right now. My family just left. And so now... We're gonna go make a snack. So. Okay, let's go. Why do I have five scrunchies in my bed? There, okay, there's literally two, but. I'm putting on a tube top over my bando right now because there's nobody here, but I hear noises a lot. And so, I don't know, there could be somebody here. There's always somebody here. So this is my OOTD. Can you tell I'm stalling? Can you tell I'm shaky? I need to eat basically because I had some caffeine earlier. But yeah, I'm stalling because I feel like somebody's in the house right now. And I don't want to go down there. Hi. 
I'm having a small crisis. My edit moment is already done there. And I still have to cut this banana. Yeah, last time I did this one, it was too thin. These all sank. Oh my goodness. Liliana Maria, you scared me. This actually looks kind of good. I'm proud of myself. I'll see you later. Or I mean, that sounds like I'm leaving. I'm not leaving. We have a lot more fun activities to do. I do you think food will definitely help? Cause I'm a little shaky. Hi, it's chat time. Yes, we're doing this in bed. By the way, if you hear waves, no, I'm not by the ocean. I'm still in the Midwest. I have a beach on the TV. Finally, it's time for us to chat. <laughs> Painting or drawing, very fun, very good. Obviously, a reminder, drink your water. Or I'll knock you over the head with this half a gallon bottle. Obviously, drink your water every day but it is essential if you have a headache, I think, probably. Another thing I almost always do, sometimes I get a little lazy. I always take peppermint essential oil. I think you're supposed to do it like behind your ears or on your temples or something. Um, I don't do that because I'm a psychopath. Maybe don't do this unless you're crazy. <laughs> but definitely peppermint oil. Get an oil diffuser like I have over there. You can't see it. Here she is. I do usually just put a drop on my hand and then Put it wherever but i had the idea to do a q-tip instead because whenever i put it on my hands i'm an idiot one time one time i put on peppermint oil before bed and i forgot that i had it on my hands still because i forgot to go wash my hands and so i took out my contacts for the night and i fried my eyeballs <laughs> It wasn't like painful. It was like cold spicy. Another word of advice I have is to stay away from electronics or social media or screens. Now let me explain before you call me a hypocrite. Yes, I have an ocean on my TV. Yes, I just watched a YouTube video on my TV. But I mean, don't like, oh, my phone's right there. I was literally looking for my phone to use it as an example. Cause I was gonna be like, don't like scroll. Oh, there's gonna be an ad soon. Lose my remote again. Am I sitting on it? No. Did I put it in my bathroom? <laughs> it's literally gone. I still don't find it, but the ocean's back, so like it just sounds like a problem for my future self. <laughs> okay, so what was I talking about? Oh, and another thing, as I showed earlier, do not, if you have one here, do not put your hair in a tight bun or ponytail on the top of your head. I don't know. Anyways, now for our, for the real discussion I'm meaning to have with you guys. Hey, I found the remote. What was I doing over here? Oh, it was, okay. It was on my dresser over there. And I got scared for a second because I was like, wait, when did I go over there? But my dishes are over there. So now I remember. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna be honest. I'm lonely <laughs> for hanging out together. So that is helping a lot. It's a good distraction from my loneliness, but like I'm going to be alone for the next like like 10 days or so. Ew. That doesn't sound very good. I'm an extrovert in case that wasn't obvious. So no, this is not my first time in the, at the rodeo. This ain't my first time at the rodeo. <laughs> so yeah, like this is nothing new to me. But yeah, I don't know. I really don't know what to do. I'm getting lonely. It's only 2.30. Oh yeah, I actually got to wake up this morning for the sunrise. I'm home alone so I can do that. The last day I actually saw a sunrise was the 13th of May. Today is the 30th of May. So let me tell you what's been going on here the past 17 days. May started off being like pretty sunny, normal weather for like spring, early summer. And then out of nowhere, it was like all clouds for days. It still is. I got lucky this morning. And so I couldn't go see the sunrise at all because I've been watching the sunrise like every chance I get since I started. And I love it and it makes me so happy. It's so pretty. And I got screwed out of so many. So let's
let's talk about my upcoming move to the beach. Is it actually happening? No. That's a great talk. Okay, I have an idea. So I'm gonna show you what I've been hatching. <laughs> okay, I've always, always wanted to have like a tapestry over my bed, you know? But I have an idea since I moved my bed here. Let's look. Uh, I take a tapestry and I like put it up here, you know, and then I connect it from here to like over there And then I know what you're thinking. What are you gonna do with this corner? Well, I'm either gonna let it <laughs> fall over depending on how it looks or if I'm feeling extra crazy I'll attach it to this chandelier Oh, that corner's gonna be up there too. Sorry, I didn't explain that. Is this making any sense? So let's just see what it would look like. I mean like worst comes worst. I just take it down, you know, so Look what I have. Can you tell what I'm thinking? Am I concerned about this falling off and crushing me when I'm trying to sleep? Mildly. Oh. I love being impulsive. I made a small minor mess in my room, so I'm gonna clean that and try relax and calm down a little bit, so. Do creepy stuff like that. <laughs> Bless you. Lily, there's your food. Bella, go eat your breakfast. She still has breakfast in there. I just heated up some leftover food from the other night. Um, I was outside and I was watching a video on YouTube and then I was editing and my dog, Bella, was like staring and like standing at the door and like whining and scratching to go in. And it really freaked me out because like she should know like there's nobody in there. So she's like at the door like, hey, let me in.
done with everything for the day, so I'm calling it a night. It's 10.35, which is... I love that. Can you shut up? <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for keeping me company today. I... I hope we had a fun time together and if you're watching this at night, uh, sleep well. Where's the other one? There she is. If you're watching this in the morning, have a beautiful day. If you're watching this in the middle of the day, have a beautiful day and a beautiful night. Yeah. Dude, I swear I'm hearing noises. Anyways, I'm gonna go to bed now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. You're welcome. <laughs>